In this video, let's take a look at the card component from Material UI. Cards contain content and actions about a single topic. Let's understand its usage with an example. Let's begin by creating a new file in the components folder muicard.tsx. Within the file, I'm going to create a new component. I'm going to import the box component and use it instead of the div tag. I'm also going to set a width of 300 pixels on the box component as the card component will take up the parent's width. So width is equal to 300 pixels. Now for a card, we need to import two components, card and card content. Next, let's add the JSX. Within the box component, invoke the card component. Within the card component, invoke the card content component. For the content, let's specify a simple text heading and description. For that, let's import typography at the top. For the heading, invoke typography, add the gutter bottom prop for some margin and let the variant be h5 but the element can be a div tag so component is equal to div. The title can be react. In the next line, invoke the typography component again but this variant will be body2 and we can also specify the color prop and set it to text.secondary. This of course is predefined in the theme palette. The text, I'm going to copy paste a two line description of React. Alright, let us now include this component in app component. Import it at the top and head to the browser. You can clearly see the card component with the heading and description. Now a card component can also contain actions at the bottom. For that, we need the card actions component. Back in VS Code, at the top, import card actions. The actions are typically buttons, so let's import the button component as well. Now below the card content, but within the card component, we can invoke card actions and add two buttons as children. The first one is going to be share, the size is going to be small, and the second button, learn more. Save the file, take a look at the browser, and we have the card actions. Share and learn more. The final part I want to cover is adding an image to the card. To include images, we need to import the card media component. Now, above the card content, but within the card, we invoke card media with the necessary props. We're going to set component to image, set a height of 140 pixels, and we specify the image source using the image prop. I'm going to use a random image from Unsplash. So https source.unsplash.com slash random. Finally, add the alt attribute for accessibility. Unsplash image. If we now head to the browser, we can see the card component with all the three parts. The media, the content, and the actions. As you can see, the card component is pretty useful when creating layouts for a single topic. In the next video, let's take a look at the accordion component from Material UI. Thank you for watching. Make sure to subscribe to the channel and I'll see you in the next one.